I need healing. I'll be watching over you. Not you. What? Me? Yes! Good day, good evening, good afternoon, good morning everyone. Mutsuzuri is here. And welcome to this video. First, I would like to thank Taka GG for sharing his content about the cancel trick. I will put this video and YouTube channel in the description below. If you are watching right now, I recommend you to watch his videos. He really has a lot of awesome content. Now, let's proceed. Do you want your mage to be your healer even if your mage doesn't have any constellations or talents that will heal your party? There's a weapon called Prototype Amber and it can be forged by blacksmiths. These are the materials needed to forge this weapon. It requires 1 Northlander Catalyst Prototype, 50 Crystal Chunk, and 50 White Iron Chunk. If you know your mining spots, gathering the ores will be nice and quick. You can mine alone, mine with friends, mine with other players, or still because you're a mean person. Stop it. Get some help. Anyway, the details about prototype Amber gliding. Using an elemental burst regenerates 4 energy every 2 seconds for 6 seconds. All party members will regenerate 4% HP every 2 seconds for this duration. So every time a character use an elemental burst, it will generate 4 energy every 2 seconds for 6 seconds. So about 12 energy. It will raise more and more as you rank it until you reach rank 5. That also includes the percentage HP every 2 seconds. It will also increase until you reach rank 5. If your mage character has massive max HP, then that character alone will be enough to sustain your team. Let's equip this to Lisa. So in my current uh, prototype Amber, I have base attack of 180, HP 19.5%, refinement rank 1, level 33. The only thing that I have difficulty in crafting this thing is not the mining spot. Acquiring the Northlander Catalyst prototype which can be only acquired through defeating bosses. Lupus Boreas, Dominator of Wolves, Child, The Golden House, and Divalin, Storm Terror. Let's put Lisa to the party. Now, let's start. So we need to fill up our energy. Okay, Elemental Burst can be triggered now. So let's go back there. The trick we're going to do is the same as what Taka Gigi did in his video we will dash and during the dash animation quickly press the switch button then press the elemental burst right before the dash animation runs out 
it will then cancel the elemental burst without spending your energy but triggering the effects of the weapon. There you have it! We are now regenerating Lisa's health. The good thing about this is you can repeat it over and over again. It feels like you have Barbara in your team, just using some lightnings. Now, is it worth it to cancel the elemental burst to regenerate the health of the party? The answer is yes. If the team is using skills or burst in order, like if you're waiting for someone to charge their burst to initiate the right combo. It also includes waiting for your party to regenerate their health until you can safely summon them back. The answer is no if the team doesn't need to regen health and the skill or burst combo is always in order. That's the end of this video. Thank you for watching. I hope you like this video and if you really do, leave a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel to support me and see you guys next time.